Hey guys, my name is Rodrigo Fondor. I'm with Asheville Cash Buyers. Uh, we're a local company that buys houses here in the Asheville, uh, North Carolina area, Buncombe County, Hayward County, Henderson County. Today, uh, I wanted to shoot this video uh, to talk about how real estate agents get paid. So how do real estate agents get paid? Agents get paid uh, on a commission from the sale. So if a property is listed at say $200,000 and it sells, right now the going commission rate is usually 6%. So 6% 6 of $200,000 would be $12,000. So let's, let's break this down. I'm gonna just break down this math for you guys really quickly, just uh, in case you're thinking about selling your house and you're curious to know how much agents get paid, uh, hopefully this gives you some insight. So let's say sale price, 200,000, okay? Right now, the going rate for real estate commissions here in Western North Carolina is 6%. Hoping I'm spelling commission correctly. 6%. This 6% is split between the buyer and the seller's agent. So each agent gets 3%. Of that 3%, so right now, this is gonna be 200, this is gonna be $12,000 of 6%, and then each agent's gonna get $6,000 as their commission because 12,000 is 6%, 6,000 is 3%, so each agent's gonna get um, that. And then depending which brokerage your buyer's agent or your listing agent's working with, some of them have to split that $6,000 up to 50% with whatever the brokerage is. So this 6% ends up becoming 3,000 because the agent splits with the brokerage. So this is a very basic structure on how uh, real estate agents get paid. As a reminder, uh, the person who pays the real estate agent is the seller. So whoever's, sell <clears throat> whoever's selling the property nine out of 10 times is the one who's paying the agents, they're paying both agents. They're paying both the list agent and they're paying both the buyer's agent. So if you're thinking of selling your house here in the Asheville area, when whatever price you list it at, you have to remember that you're at least gonna be taking 6% off the top to cover the cost of the agents. And once that 6% comes off the top, the buyer's agent is getting 3%, the listing agent's getting another 3%, and then that percentage so in this scenario, that $6,000 per agent is gonna get whittled down. It's gonna get split between the agent and their brokerage some more. In some cases, it can be as high as 50%. So if you had any questions regards to how agents get paid, uh, obviously you should ask the listing agent that you're working with specifically to break it down for you because there's variations for every agent and for every brokerage that, uh, that you might be working with. Um, so this is just a rule of thumb just to give you a general idea of how agents get paid here in the area. If you have any questions, reach out to us. I would also encourage you to reach out directly to whatever agent you're thinking about working with. Take care.